in this video i'm going to show you how you can create this effect that you've seen popularly on facebook or instagram or wherever so before i actually jump into this i would like to give credit to um where i actually got the concept from i actually had the idea already but the concept was originally from us in this key so you can watch this video actually on his channel but anyways i won't waste your time here so let's just get started so the thing is that you can create it with a with an image that has a background and you can also create it with wow oh we even got a new concept like this so these are just practicing this out so when we come up with this idea I'll sh you can use this same concept you have seen this image here to work on your design so i won't waste much time so let me just jump right into this so the first thing you want to do is to import the image you want to use import the image you want to use so i'll just leave this image here decide just make sure you resize it so you are okay with it whatever size you use is actually okay of course that's be the down section there so as soon as you've done that you click on this image right now i have this image selected i'll go to the color sat saturation and then reduce the color filters and reduce the saturation all the way to the end it's not a must it must be 100 as long as you are reducing it you can see the effect that is applying on the screen so just do well to reduce it to your own taste i'll leave it at 100 and then i'll save this um, picture right now so i'll click on save save as image select png and select um ultra so i've already saved this already so there's no need on repeating that so i'll just so just click on save and you have this black um effect on your screen as soon as you've done that the next thing you need to do is to import your um, paper text effect so this is actually no ad and as you can see on screen this is the prompt i use paper text effect so all you need to do is to scroll down and download this type of um paper text effect i recommend you download this type of this paper cut effect as soon as you've downloaded the paper cut effect all you need to do is to import it in pixel lab so as soon as you've imported this in pixel lab i don't want to actually mess with the size anymore so as soon as you've imported this in pixel lab resize it to where you actually want first you need to do to reduce your opacity so you can see um where all this you know the all this line at the edges are touching on your design i resized my own to it got to this point so you can see i just kept it it got to this point so you have to make sure it, it's not in a weird place like you know cutting your face or joint. just make sure it's okay it's okay this is actually still okay so you want this reduce your passes so you can see it so uh, yeah which is your persistence so you can see so i'll just undo this because i don't want to tamper with anything anymore so this is um this for this so the next thing you need to do is to um increase your opacity back all the way to the end disable your layer for this and make sure it is in a transparent background make sure this is in a transparent background so as soon as this is in a transparent background save this again save as image select png and select ultra like i said I've already saved this so there's no point in saving it again so as soon as you save this let me just go back real quick just give me a second so as soon as you save this all you need to do is to enable your main image um your main image and import the um paper cut effect that you just saved so i import the paper cut effect real quick like remember it's in a transparent background so you can see this size to be so don't tamper with this size now or less it will affect the way it was before so all you need to do is to click on the middle um, section here click on relative size make sure you don't touch anything else this maintain ratio shouldn't be disabled so just increase this all the way to 100 so you see i've increased it all the way to 100 it came back to the original position that it was before so since this is it um just the the paper cut effects go to texture click on this icon here and select the black um this thing that we use the black um, um image we saved so i'll select the black image you save real quick as soon as i um, selected that it will be like this so let me just click on this check mark icon so i don't want that line that you see to show i'll click on stroke and enable the stroke so you can see the stroke is actually okay at two you can give it under color you want this is actually nice so but let's keep it at white so you can increase the stroke if you want this is also nice so now there's even you're even getting new concept with this you can increase the stroke or use another image if you especially if you're working on a birthday design i don't know if i still have the design on screen in my on my phone if i have it you see it on screen if i don't have it you don't see it so you can see this concept that we generated let me just the stroke is too much let me disable this the stroke is too much so this is it let me show you this concept that we generated this concept i'm talking about you can use another image for this 
another image for this um so you can see and then you just put it in your bed design anyway if the better design is still on my phone you see it on screen like i said i put it actually on my phone so this is how you can actually create this effect that you have seen with the help of pixel lab like i said i'm giving credit to um Bosiniski for actually bringing out the concept on how you can create this effect with the help of pixel lab i'll leave um, a link to this video in the comment section or in the description so you guys should do it to check that out as well so once again thank you boss in this key for giving us this concept and i hope that this video will actually help anyone watching this so you can do it to share this to a friend and of course subscribe to my channel